Hello, happy Wednesday. All right, we're going to start off in the, the newer of the two song packets today. Uh, first, we'll do the first page where we have Come As You Are, and we'll play along with uh, Nirvana today. So here goes, E minor and D starting off. <laughs> go to Wish You Were Here, which is the next uh, page in the packet. Quick review of the chords that you need. So E minor 7, of course you can do it the simple way of just 5th uh, string, 2nd fret, but the, the better way to do it would be um, to start with the fancy version of G from Good Riddance, 2nd finger on the 6th string, 3rd fret, 1st finger on the 5th string, 2nd fret, third finger on the second string, third fret, pinky on the first string, third fret, and then for um, E minor 7, you move this top finger here so that you wind up with fifth string and fourth string, both on the second fret. Doesn't matter what order they go in. And then the A7 suspended, you wind up with fourth string. Ah, let's angle this better here. 4th string, 1st fret. So once again, G, E minor 7. I like to do it by moving both fingers. I find that easier. Everything just kind of slides nicely. And then 
A7 suspended, that lifts up. And there we go. And if you're doing the plucking, the, uh, the uh, tab playing at the beginning, we hit the fifth string, hammer on to the second fret, sorry I missed, then go to the fourth string, pluck, pluck. Let's play along with Pink Floyd. First we listen to the radio station.
takes over. <clears throat> so now, two things uh, that are relevant for things you need to turn in soon. First of all, uh, I'll go through Good Morning Blues. This is in the original book, page 86, recapping that our chord progression is E. Three times, a fourth time, then we go to A. Twice only, and then back to E. Then we go B7, in case you forgot B7. Recapping here, first finger on the fourth string, first fret. Second fingers on the fifth string, second fret. Third finger on the third string, second fret. Pinky on the first string, second fret. That's B7, then I go back to A7, and then E. Good morning blues time. A one and two, pay attention to the rhyme scheme as you go, as you are coming up with your own blues lyrics for Friday. When in doubt, you could always start with woke up this morning and fill something in. So here we go, E. Good morning, blues. Blues, how do you do? A7, good morning, blues. Blues, how do you do? Here comes B7 next. I'm doing all right. A7, good morning, how are you? just come up with words. You could come up with words and perform them. You could perform it with words and a slightly different tune if you want to. So, you know, depends how far you want to go with that. All right, and now the chromatic scale. This is on page 59 from the other book. You have the, the uh, attachment that I sent reminding you that on every string you want to make sure that you use all your fingers except for the third string where we only go up to three. Remember only three frets on string three. So I start off, I'm going to do it once all the way through without stopping. Two, ready, sixth string and open. One, two, three, four. Next string, open. One, two, three, four. Next string, open. One and hold. Two, two, Repeat the two here, and two, three, four, next string, open, one, two, three, next string, open, one, two, three, four, hold, two, three, I'm coming down, and open, then four, three, two, one, open, three, two, one, open, four, three, then hold, two, two, three, repeat the two, two, one, zero, four, three, two, one, zero, four, three, two, one, zero. Just going through it a little more slowly this time, sort of string by string. On the way up, I go, oh, one, two, three, four. Then on the next string, same thing. Oh, one, two, three, four. Then fourth string, I just do zero, one, two, I hold that. I'm going to restart from the two. I'm going to go two, three, four. Here comes the famous third string where I just do open, one, two, three. I do not do four because it would sound the same as the next note I'm about to play, which is open second string, open, one, two, three, four, and I go open first string. Now on the way down, make sure that on the way down you start, first of all, make sure that you, um, first we do open first string. Now we go right to four, four, three, two, one. Don't forget to play the open string. Now I go third string, third fret, three, two. Again, don't forget the open string here. Now I go to the fourth string, four, 
three, hold two. I repeat the two, add a two, one, zero. Next, four, three, two, one, zero. Then four, three, two, one. Oh. All right. And I will wrap it up for today with Stand By Me. You can find this in either song packet. In the new one, it's on the last page. And I'm going to do this in the key of C major. And I'm going to use the bar chord shape for the F chord. As well as the G chord. A slide like that to show how you can keep the same shape from F to G. But of course, you could do this F and the normal G, or that G. It's up to you. All right, so here we go. One, two, three, and C. A minor. F. G. C. When the night has come and the land is dark, chance to do some brainstorming on blues lyrics as needed and practice the chromatic scale. There you have it. All right. Have a good day. We'll see you tomorrow.